Hey guys, welcome back to the Fragrance Wardrobe. I'm Michael, and today I'm going to review Bulgari's Man in Black. Great fall scent, great winter scent, pretty much a great all-around scent. Also, at the end of this video, I am doing a giveaway, so stay tuned to the end so you can find out how to enter the giveaway. So let's go ahead and begin with the presentation. Bulgari Man in Black is going to come in a box. For those of you who care about the box, it looks like this. Looks like this, has the name, Eau de Parfum Concentration. I have the 50 ml. There's the top, there's the side, side, bottom. Yeah, and there's the bottom with the batch code and there goes the box. Okay, the bottle. Bottle presentation looks like this. You have this, it's all raised up where you see Bulgari. The man part is not. You have that nice black kind of shininess on the top and then it goes matte. Nice kind of a rose, yeah, it's like rose gold. Atomizer is pretty cool on this. I really enjoy it so you don't lose a cap. You just twist it and it like unlocks the atomizer. Twist it back, it's not going to spray. So look, not, not spraying. Twist it and boom, beautiful distribution. And that smells really, really good. In fact, it is my scent of the day. It smells so beautiful. I've been waiting for the weather to cool down so I can wear this. And we got a cold front in North Texas the temperature is dropping rapidly throughout the day. I think we're probably around 50 right now. I think we're supposed to get down to 45. So, ah, getting to wear a Bulgari Man in Black and it smells so good. Bulgari Man in Black was released in 2010. It's a warm, spicy fragrance. It has notes of amber, leather, it has spices, uh, natural rum, it has tuberose, iris, absolute, leather, and it also has at the base benzoin, tonka bean, and guyac wood. It does have pretty decent note breakdown. I'm going to spray it one more time so I can describe the opening to you guys. And we'll get a slow motion of this shot right here. Ready? Do it one more time. Ooh, nice. Yeah, it smells really good. Um, you do, in the opening, catch that rum, that booziness, a little bit of spiciness. It's very warm, making it making it pretty much a fall, winter fragrance. Can you wear it in the warmer weather? I guess you could. I'd go super light on the trigger. But, because I do think you can wear whatever you want, whatever you want. But this one is definitely made for that colder weather, fall, and winter. The, let's smell this thing. Yeah, you kind of catch a booziness from the rum, but you also have a spicy and woodiness to it. It's a very smooth fragrance. There's not sharp edges around it, anything like that. It's very, very warm, very relaxing. Really, I think this would be really good for the holidays as well with that kind of that rum, booziness, spiciness that's in it with the woods. It's a really nice fragrance. Um, I don't really know any other way to describe it besides the words I've already told you guys. Definitely get a sample of it. I think it's going to be pretty mass uh, appealing for a winter slash fall or fall slash winter fragrance. Uh, sometimes those uh, seasonal fragrances can be divisive, but this one I think is pretty safe. I don't think you're going to run into too many people that aren't going to like this fragrance. Now, I wouldn't go too heavy on the trigger if you're going to wear it in the office or anything like that because it is a little bit strong. Brings us to the performance. Performance is pretty decent on this one. I get about seven hours to eight hours of performance on this. It is an Uday Parfum concentration. And the projection, it goes pretty strong for about an hour to two hours. After that, it does kind of hang out close to the skin, and it's not a skin scent. 
after the first hour or two, but it does stay a little bit closer. So people will have to be closer to catch those wafts of it. But within that hour to that two hours of spraying it, you will be projecting. So if you're going to wear it to the office or something like that, might want to go easy on it or just spray it well before you get to work. Performance outside is actually really good. Like I said, we have a cold front. It's windy. The air is actually pretty chilly right now. And it it performs really well outside. This one, I could see people wearing to go like see Christmas lights and that kind of thing. We do that, me and my family. We go check out Christmas lights and stuff around that time of the year. So if you're into that, going maybe in like those horse carriages to do it this one's going to be pretty killer for events like that Talk about brass tacks how much is this one going to cost i don't i think i said that i got the 50 mil correction this is actually a two ounce 60 mil i don't know if they make a 50 mil of this uh there is the 100 mil now the price is pretty decent if you go to a discounter i personally went to fragrance x and bought this from them it's $42 and some change for the 60 mil bottle if you wanted if you wanted to grab the 100 mil you're looking at about you're looking at about 64 65 dollars uh, pretty good also I would I would check kingdom fragrances to see if he has this in stock a lot of times uh, the fragrances that he has I'd say most of the time if not all the time is going to be priced below what like Fragrance X and Fragrance Net are charging. And that's without even having to use a discount code. You can usually get it a lot cheaper at Kingdom Fragrances. I will link that website in the description as well as Fragrance X and I guess Fragrance Net and Forever Lux. I'll just link all the all of the uh, discounters below so you can check it out, pick the best price or best shipping, whatever works best for you. Now, I am doing a giveaway. Um, if you'll look down at my subscriber count, it's like 40. Well, it might be a little bit less or a little bit more when this comes out. But as I'm shooting this, it's 40 subscribers. So, no, I'm not giving away a full bottle um, because all my giveaways are out of pocket. I don't have monetization because I don't have a thousand subscribers and I don't have sponsors or anything like that. So if I'm giving stuff away, I'm giving it out of my pocket and shipping it out of my pocket. So it's not a big one, but as the channel grows, I'll do better giveaways. But I thought since I had a decant of Bulgari made in black and I have the bottle now, I thought I'd go ahead and give away the decant. Now I did originally smell this from the decant. I did not blind buy it, which I typically blind buy. But I got, I do have a couple of the monthly subscriptions, which kind of a waste of money, but kind of convenient and kind of don't know if I want to keep them or not. But anyway, I got a month supply in this decant right here. Supposedly it's a month supply if you do four sprays a day for 30 days, something like that. But you can see it says Bulgari made in black and I've sprayed it. I sprayed it one or two times because the first time I sprayed it, I decided I had to have a bottle and I put it back in this tube like that, sealed it up, ordered the bottle, waited for the bottle to get here. So I haven't even like really worn it out of this. So it's, it's full. Now, if you want to be entered for the giveaway, I need you to do a couple things for me. Help me out a little bit. Give this video a like. Please do subscribe. I recommend ringing the bell so you get notified when I announce the winner as well as when I have new content or new giveaways, you'll get notified. And in the comment section, just comment, pick me. You can comment, pick me, P-I-C-K-M-E. Let me know you wanna be picked for the giveaway. You can add more to your comment if you'd like. Now, I'm going to use a random comment picker. So it's going to pick somebody's comment and I'm going to check the comment if it says, pick me I'll send it to you if it doesn't I'm going to assume you didn't want to be entered into the drawing so uh, do you know put pick me in your comment but anyway that's it great fragrance from Bulgari um, man in black 
I think it's a must have for the fall and the winter time. It's really good and has a really nice, sophisticated, elegant scent to it and uh, performs pretty well at a decent price. So I appreciate all you guys watching. Please remember, like, share, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications, and I will catch you guys with the next video. Thank you.